Yes, and we got three women in the studio today that needed some major pampering, and they are all very polished now. So we are going to show you their afters. But first, their befores. We're going to start with Brenda. Brenda is our biker mom. She's got four kids, seven grandkids, and she was addicted to this ponytail. This is what she looked like when she came into our studio. Take a look at Brenda now. <laughs> I never knew I could look like this, yes. so I am really impressed. Very nice. Your girls are in the front row, a couple of daughters, um, two out of the four. Ladies, what do you think of the non-ponytail look? Set it on fire. <laughs> she set it on fire. Beautiful. 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 Okay, let's bring the team in here. Jeff Altenberg, Shampoo Planet, Derek Selby, our beauty expert. All of you get in here. Let's bring them in here and let's talk about this great look. So there was some fear about getting rid of the pony. There was. Oh, we had, uh, there we had she that is. little chat, but sorry, honey. You ready? Yeah. It's going down. Okay. Oh. Going down. <laughs> but you feel good about it, right? I, I never knew because I got stuck in that phase of just putting it on and out the door I go. Totally. And so now having this haircut, I never liked short hair, but now yeah. I'm okay with this. It looks so good on you and we all get stuck. Yeah. You know, sometimes you need a professional to come around and give us a little bit of a nudge, but we all go through that. So this is beautiful for you. Derek, come on in here and let's talk about her makeup. Watch the pony. Watch the pony. <laughs> I might want to wear that it's later. Done. Yeah. So with Brenda, because she has that sort of freedom is one of the things that we sort of discovered as it was happening is go for fresh, glowy skin, mm -hmm. which is youthful. Mm -hmm. And then a little bit of smokiness around the eyes and then did a bright pop of color on her lips, which again was shine, which is that youthful kind of quality. Yeah. And we were saying to her, it's like she doesn't need to hide behind makeup and hair. It's like she's beautiful and has amazing personality. Yes. Go for it. She's youthful. This looks like, this just looks like a more sophisticated version right. of you, but yeah. like so pretty, yeah. so pretty. Let's talk about this great outfit. So Janice Meredith has been pulling for you all. Janice, what a great look for her. Oh, well, when I met Brenda, she had so much personality, but she really wanted to control what she was picking out, so she had to let go, and she did that very well. And we went, and she was very open with trying on things, and I love this pantsuit on her, this jumpsuit. It's so great. It really shows up her shape, and Le Chateau was perfect for her. I love it. Yes, I love it too. It looks great on you. It fits your personality. I say onesies for life, onesies forever. I think they're amazing. <laughs> looks so good on you. Okay. It's time to see Anina now. Now, Anina as well, uh, so much hair. It was just growing by the second. And so this is what she looked like when she came into our studio. Three kids, she never gets her own hair cut, but theirs gets cut. Let's take a look at Anina now! <laughs> your hair like this? No, never, ever. So it's a very dramatic, different change, but I love it. <laughs> it moves, it's got body, yeah. it's voluptuous, and you look gorgeous as well. Thank Beautiful you so makeup. Much. I'm, in, I'm very impressed with what the crew did with me today. <laughs> Let's meet the crew. So it was Sal Leonetti. This is Philippe Florio. Yeah. Tracy here on makeup. You're not Sal. I'm not Sal. <laughs> so Sal had to go. Where did Sal go? Well, I think he got tired because of so much hair, and he just, <laughs> he needed to go and have lunch and have a nap, but. He had his daughter's graduation, guys. He had his daughter's graduation, so he had to go, and of course, that's important. He's a, he's a great dad. Great so dad. we'll let you fill in and sort of walk us through Sal what he did. Sal did a beautiful job. You know, he, he did this bohemian chic kind of wave oh. happening. He brought up the length. You can't do too many layers when you're working with this much hair. You do more layers, the bigger it gets. Right. It's something that she can control herself. It'll be easy. She can still do the bun, which is going to be yeah. the go-to because this isn't practical.
practical for every day when you're busy and it's humid and it's hot. But Sal did a gorgeous job. It's a beautiful makeover, Sal did. Super sexy. He did. Like, yeah. oh my gosh. Yeah. Trace, come on in here and let's talk about her beautiful makeup. I like how it's subtle and it's pretty. Mm -hmm. I wanted to keep it subtle. I remember when I wrung my hands and I was laughing like I was going <laughs> to do a lot to her. But I, I didn't want to take her too far from what she's used to. Yeah. So I just I thickened the eyebrows a little bit. And a tip for um, if you want to look a little bit more youthful, thicken the eyebrows. They're a little yes. bit more youthful. When they're, you keep them really thin, 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 paper thin, they, they age you a lot, all right? Yes. So I, I thickened them a little bit and I did add a little bit of lashes. Nice. So I, 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 I glammed her up a little bit in that way. And then if you can just close your eyes, I just did again that like a cherry kind of chocolate color that I put all over the eyes. And then I give her a pop of lips. It's beautiful. Looks so gorgeous. And this color is everything. Janice, let's talk about this outfit. <laughs> Thanks. No, that we, we went in with a plan for like, let's really embrace the summer colors, the summer florals. And so we picked out these great things. She was comfortable in a nice skinny pant. Uh, and so we went really floaty and bright and lovely on the top. And I think she looks amazing. I think she looks amazing. And I think this is the sort of thing you can wear day, you can wear night. It's going to be very accessible. It's comfortable. You look fabulous, honey. Thank you so much. So good. Fabulous. Good. That's all we want to know here. Okay, so let's talk about Angela now. Yeah. Angela, also a mom of three, she's got a super stressful job. She comes home and then she's a full-time mom. So full-time working outside the home, full-time working in the home. This is how Angela looked when she came into our studio today. We wanted to give her a new look. So Angela, come on out. <laughs> It was amazing. You had a good time with your team? I did, I did. I feel pretty. <laughs> oh, and you look pretty. I'm so happy. You know, that's a feeling that is underestimated, but you should feel pretty, right, doing everything you do. Let's welcome the team, and Philippe is back. Philippe Fiorio, glorious look. Dino Gilio, gorgeous job on the makeup. Let's start with this hair. Yeah, gorgeous. I mean, that's that's it says it all right there. She feels pretty. Yes. There's nothing more rewarding. Uh, there's nothing that gives me a bigger high than when you can touch somebody physically and make them feel their best. Absolutely. And, you know, we, we took out that density. We gave her, you know, it, it's easy. It's easy hair. It just it frames her face now. She's wearing the hair instead of the hair wearing her. Absolutely. And I think it just suits her. Very good. That's what you wanted. Dino, let's talk about mm -hmm. this beautiful face, those lips. Those lips are gorgeous. Those are, believe it or not, the eyelid color and the highlight on her cheek and on her lip is the same eyeshadow. Wow. So just so, so with gold, you don't have to buy everything that matches a gold blush, a gold mm -hmm. shadow, gold lip gloss. Can incorporate, and then what I did was I put a gold lip gloss on top Stunning. to give the finish. So it's really, you know, very glamorous, but yeah. still really kind of day to night, yes. work to play. She's a golden Fun. goddess. Yeah. She's beautiful. Janice, let's talk about this outfit you pulled for her. Love the florals. Yes, again, we wanted to do florals and we wanted to really highlight her shape and a jumpsuit is perfect for that. I have to admit, all three of these ladies were lovely and we, when we met at the store, they all go along and were chatting and when and one outfit was picked, they would stay to see what else was happening. So it was a great group, but I think she looks fantastic. I'm so happy. And I think it's nice as well when we get all of you together and you just have a great experience with it because I think a lot of us, come on in here everyone, a lot of us go out there to try on clothing and it's sometimes not the best experience because we might feel, you know, bad putting on the pants or the jeans. It's nice that you all had a great time. Janice, you did a great job, and, and you guys actually went shopping at Le Chateau, didn't you? Yes. Well, you are going to keep all of these outfits from Le Chateau. <laughs> You can do the job in that, do all of the momming, um, and, and I like the fact that you, we're all out of ruts now, aren't we? So we're not going to go back to the ponytail as soon as the show's off air. No, 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 not right away. <laughs> and then we're not going to go back to growing our hair for the rest of our life and never cutting it again, right? And no bun, because you don't need it. Thank you so much to our incredible team.